Well, I told Jaha it's definitive. The Ark's got a year of oxygen left, maybe two. Number 10. Jake thought it would be a good idea to let people know that there was no oxygen left in the Ark. Unfortunately for him, revealing that kind of information is considered treason. of our people clock. Number 9. Dante Wallace. None of us has a choice here, Clark. I didn't want this. Neither did I. I didn't really think Clark was going to pull the trigger on this one. But once again, she was doing what was best for her people. Lesson learned. Don't mess with Clark. Next up. We see Clark and Bellamy pulling the lever. And radiation in three, two, one. Now we see Jasper desperately running. But unfortunately for him, it's too late. Number eight, Maya. <laughs> Can it get any worse than being burned from radiation? Maya's death is also known as the beginning of Jasper's spiral. <laughs> Where's that? Your father didn't make it. Number 7, Hannah Green. Things are never easy for Monty. I mean, Having to decide whether or not to kill your mom because she's possessed by an AI? Looks like Clark is not the only one making tough decisions here. Mom, stop! Stop when you take this! Never! Stop! Mom! Don't make me do this! Stop! Guys, I cannot tell you how intense this moment was for me. It gave me the chills, and to this day, it's one of the most difficult to watch scenes for me on The 100. Next up, we have the beautiful looking queen, Naya. So you want to establish yourself as a true leader of the Grounders? There's only one way to do that. What up? Time you what up? Time you no no one up Khan Heimlacher. Kill one of the clan leaders who's challenging you, and you also distrust. She strange you stand. And here's one of the reasons why Alexa was so worshipped. May we meet again, my queen. Number 5. Lincoln. You know, I don't think I ever thought it was gonna go well for Lincoln and Sky Crew. However, I didn't think it was gonna end like this either. Definitely one of the characters that we'll miss in future seasons of The 100. Next up is Emerson. This whole scene plays like a horror movie, with the last of the mountain men kidnapping and trying to kill several Sky Crew, including Clark. Yeah. Ascending superiors. Ho oh, buddy, this is on you, Emerson. Clark did try to give you a chance. Ugh! <laughs> 
So you clearly know Nightblood, and you shouldn't have messed with Clark in the first place. Number 3. Reckless Bat Boy Finn Confident, good looking, and always looking out for Clark. What's not to like about him? They even had a brief fling together, back when he thought he'd never see Raven again. Fast forward to him losing his mind, and massacring 17 grounders, and subsequently having to pay for it. You gotta admit that Clark never had it easy on the ground, and she has always been faced with tough decisions. Thanks, princess. <laughs> Number 2, Alexa. Alexa. Did anyone see it coming? I would say it was another premature death on the hundred. Forgive me, Adam. I'm trying to bash your clock so I can help you. There are still some people out there that think that she might make a comeback, but the fact is that she's dead. I mean, unless you count her living soul that's in the flame. Welcome, Thelonians. I'm glad you made it. Number one, Ali. An AI created to make life better for mankind? And she did have good intentions, I'll give her that. Black rain will come first. There will be no drinkable water. Would you really condemn the human race to die in six months? Now fast forward to her death scene. Me, are you crazy? I'm not gonna pump her heart- Now! So we have manual heart pumping, Nightblood Transfusion, AI possessed Sky Crew trying to get to Clark, full on war in Polis. I mean, talk about a season finale. Everything's going on at once. Alright, so there you have it, I hope you liked the video, don't forget to comment and subscribe.